dun, da, da, da. And we have a dilemma going on right now. You look like we're in a war, and I'm throwing a grenade at you. <laughs> Okay, so we got beds yet to plant because it's not warm enough. But we have chamomile, garlic, and potatoes there. And we did put some carrot and beet seeds in the ground. And then we have this new blueberry and something else bed, whatever we decide. And behind that are the two sun choke beds. So we're going to make this soil a little more acidic for the blueberries. One bed in the middle here. That tarp is full of wood shavings for the compost toilet and the compost and everything. And yeah, we're getting quite a little garden here started. Those of you who uh, are watching now, tell all the new folks who are watching in June and July when they see a thriving garden out here, tell them all the heartache and cold and wet pain that they miss.
wood chip in time. Let me show you how much I have to wood chip. It's a lot. This whole pile keeps going. Keeps going. It's a lot. It's a lot of wood chipping. Like, I don't know if he likes to smell like pine or what his deal is, but he's got a super fetish for, especially the pine wood chips. And a compost puma. Watch. Nice wood chips, babe. Thanks. I make this one more acidic for the blueberries. Wish I had some help stomping all this down. Hey, load up. Load up. Stomp it down. Stomp it down. Let's go. Stomp it down. Come on, Puma. Come on.
Hey, as I'm working out here, I'm starting to get mosquitoes. Yeah, they're coming. They're on the back of my ears and they're on my arms and my elbows and why? They're not supposed to come till like the end of April. Let's just cut one and see what happens. Our bedroom, the bunkie. All right, so all these pieces have numbers on them, so I'm just gonna sort them to make it easier for us. Cause you're just gonna build it kind of like a Lego set, uh, match the numbers up as it says in the instructions. Boom, boom, boom. You got yourself a bunkie. Sucker. <laughs> that would be like Dexter. <laughs> God. I wouldn't do that. All right, in the last episode, you guys saw that we're building this bunkie from Sawmill Structures, and it's the Harvest model. And it's basically a log cabin that's been pre cut. Um, all the pieces you're going to see us put together right now are log cabin style. They're going to fit together, and it's going to go up very fast. Hopefully. What do you think about the size? I think it's good. I think it's really good. I'm getting excited. <laughs> and again, for those people that missed the last episode, it got, I think, a million views in the first four days. And what uh, is this structure going to be? It's going to be our bedroom. And we're going to do a connecting hallway um, going from the yurt into here. So, As you guys have watched us for a couple of years, we built and live in a yurt, a 30-foot size yurt. And it's basically a studio apartment. The bedroom is in there, the kitchen's in there, the living room, the wood stove, it's all in there. And then by taking the bedroom out of the yurt, putting it in this bunkie, it's going to allow you to do what with the yurt? Um, I have way more space. And then we'll have a hallway, so it'll be like our mud room. Anyway, let's, uh, we're, yeah, we got the foundation done, and so now we are following the instructions that Sawmill Structures gave us and we're gonna put it together, and it looks pretty easy, honestly, so. And I think that I misspoke in the last episode. I think that it comes with the floor and the roof rafters. Yeah, I think so. It looks like it. We won't know until we get there. Let's find out. It's gonna be like a witch's cottage in the forest, like Hansel and Gretel. <laughs> Let's do this. Let's 
Песня. And I'm throwing a grenade at you. Ready? Like I'm grabbing stuff, and I'm like. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Load up, Puma. Load up. Load up. Whoa, Whoa. Kai's the balance king today. Puma, what happened to your balance reputation? Load up, let's go. Oh, he lost his confidence. Come on, load up. There you go, you did it. Thank you, blue boys. Thank you, blue boys. Okay. <sighs> tap it in, yeah? Just tap it in. Give it a little tappy. Tap, tap, tap a root. all the way on. <laughs> hey, you're gonna see Nicole and I using rubber hammers and uh, sticks to go in the joints and tap it in. Good job. I let Nicole be in charge of the schematic and telling me how to put this together and she's like a Nazi. Hey, I ain't scared, I ain't scared, I ain't... <laughs> oh my god. Yes ma'am, sorry. Is this an eight or a four on this side? It's an eight, Jake. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, I gotta, screw the, I gotta screw these in. Dude, that's what I said, I said screw it in. And then put number eight there. Yes, ma'am. Sorry, ma'am. <laughs> Kow tow. Isn't this fun? To the fear. <laughs> the fear of the bunkie. The beer. Look, this is where our front door's gonna go. That's so big. Yeah. Harvest model's a double door. We have double doors? I'm pretty sure, yes. French doors? Look at the picture. What? Okay, here's the one that's true. This is the first one we put in this way. Yeah, I think we're okay now. Now that I've seen how this goes, I think we're okay. I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm telling you, you get to go hard. Yep, there you go. You hear that crack? Do you want it? Here, watch, watch, watch. I feel like there's something wrong with my stick. No, no, no. Something wrong with my stick? You just keep it a square. It's so, it's so freaking wet here. That this has been here now for two weeks. It's swollen and everything is gonna fit together real snug. Once it's done and the roof is on and the wood stove's in there, it'll dry out a little bit and be comfortable. But it's gonna take a lot of effort for us to pound this together. Luckily, it still fits and it's okay.
coverage. Hey, what do you think? I think it's looking awesome. <laughs> it's like a legit little, what did you say it's like? Um, Lincoln Logs. Have you ever, if you guys have ever heard of Lincoln Logs or played with Lincoln Logs as a kid, this is seriously just like it and it's so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> but your Lincoln Log background is serving you well right now. Yes. Get it. Hey, the mosquitoes are all over my arms. Like I need to get my jacket back on. Do it. They're you're they're slack, out already. You're slacking. Club. I feel like I'm freaking Neanderthal caveman. I feel like one too. That's so <clears throat> funny. <clears throat> Bunky. Hammer Jake. Bill Bunky house for girl. Mm. <laughs> you don't feel like that? I feel like I'm supposed to build this and like light fire, wood stove, and then grab you by the hair and like drag you in like a caveman. Oh my god. You know, like the old cartoons you see? Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Gonna just cut the edges off to make a little gap in case it swells with moisture and then we're gonna put baseboards around the the floor inside okay take off your shoes you have to do it you have to take off your shoes what do you think it's very nice. <laughs> hey, what's with these socks you're wearing here? Where did these come from? A fan. <laughs> a fan sent us these socks. To the P.O. box? Yeah. That's They're cool. Like a bunch of tie-dyed socks. Um, so is that it? We just like look at the stars all night? Yeah. Yeah, that's it. That's it? This is the build? <laughs> it's so beautiful. I think, I think we're 80% done. We have to just do the windows, doors, and the roof rafters. Yes. And we have a dilemma going on right now. Why? It's like always our dilemma. The sun is going down and we would like to finish today. Because we've had two days of no rain. Of no rain. So tomorrow, like, you know, it's no problem for us to finish it the next day. But, like, it's supposed to rain hard tomorrow. Starting at, at what like time? 8 o'clock in the morning. We're going to try to get as much done as we can before the sun goes down. So let's, let's do it. Let's do it. Hey, and then uh, we walk out the front door and do the hippie hot tub right behind you. I know. It's going to be so nice. I love this. This is really freaking cool. It is. I mean, this is a cool thing. I like both these. They're cool. Yeah. Well, let's get the windows and door on because the floor looks amazing. I'm going to tie my shoes back on. <laughs> Do you like the height we built the uh, the bunkie and the platform? It's nice and high, yeah? That's nice. And we planted that cherry tree out there. It's going to be blooming right in front of the bunkie. Back to work. <laughs> yes, Russian dictator, Nicole. <laughs> let's see that. I agree with you. There's no way to get it on once we have everything else. Hey, Bear! This is cool. Alright. It is cool. Right now. It's so pretty. <laughs> Isn't it pretty? 
Yeah, you love it. It's so cute. Oh. <laughs> it's so cute. Side down.
Nice shirt. <gasps> oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Not mean for that to happen. <laughs> Are you okay? I'm gonna rain my eye. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Thanks. No, I love the sweaty. I love the hoodie. <laughs> I'm sweaty. I'm sorry. No, I. Go ahead.